एवरी वन वेलकम टू हील चाम शाइन टूडे वी आर डूइंग अनादर वीडियो विद लव नोट्स येस्टडे वेन आई डिड अ वीडियो नॉट येस्टडे इन द लास्ट वीडियो वेन आई यूज लव नोट्स आई फॉगॉट टू यूज इट फॉर पायल थ्री एंड आई वॉज रियली सॉरी अबाउट इट द रीडिंग वॉज एक्चुअली वेरी नाइस वेरी इमोशनल एंड इट इट जस्ट किप्ट माई माइंड सो आई डिसाइडेड टू मेक वन मोर वीडियो यूजिंग लव नोट्स सो दैट हु एवर मिस्ड आउट ऑन इट विल कैन हैव अनादर रीडिंग राइट अवे सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी हाउ विल दे कन्वे दे फीलिंग्स टू यू और हाउ विल दे एक्सप्रेस दे फीलिंग्स टू यू योर फ्यूचर स्पॉस हाउ विल दे एक्सप्रेस दे फीलिंग्स टू यू दैट दैट इज टूडेज वीडियो आई होप यू विल एन्जॉय टूडेज वीडियोज एज मच एज यू डिड लास्ट टाइम ऑल्सो आई एम वेरी हैप्पी दैट यू गाइज आर एन्जॉइंग लव नोट्स दैट वॉज समथिंग विच केम टू मी इन अ वेरी स्मूथ वे आई एम वेरी प्राउड ऑफ दोज नोट्स दे आर वेरी फनी क्यूट स्वीट रोमांटिक सो आई रियली होप यू एन्जॉय दिस रीडिंग एज वेल सो आई सी इन योर पायल यू हैव दीज गॉज एस कार्ड्स इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू यू can choose as per your own method or you can stick to the same pile you chose in the last reading because i'm trying to make this as a continuation it doesn't have to be you can choose multiple piles as well um i hope you enjoy the reading i'll see you in your pile number 1 so today what we are doing is we are making another video using love notes what happened last in the last video i uh, by mistake i uh, missed out or i uh, forgot to use the love notes in pile number 3 and uh, that was a pure mistake it what happened because i got carried away with so sweet and deep feelings which were coming out in the reading and uh, it just skipped my mind so to you know make up for it i'm doing another video with love notes and i hope this will this will uh, be you know as romantic as the last video was the last video was fantastic i really enjoyed it so i'm trying to make this as a continuation so last videos was your future spouse's thoughts about you today's video is your future spouse how will they express their feelings for you like how will they express their feelings for you that is today's video so let's see uh, what is happening so now we know their thoughts now let's look at their feelings you don't have to stick to the same pile uh, which you have chosen the last reading you can go for a new pile or you can go for multiple piles as well um this is your beautiful card i really really like the way this card is shown over here so many colors it's so pretty and we can see the chakras also like the uh, third eye chakra the third eye let there be closeness between you but always give each other space love never claims it simply allows and gives wow so yes there is this beautiful connection it shows like you both are wise enough to know when you can when you need to give sorry when you need to give space and when you need to be there to support the other person so you both know how to cherish how to love each other you both know that what the other one will like and what the other one will find as uncomfortable or overbearing and that is what that is what is making this connection coming closer so your future spouse loves the way you do not overpower or um, you know you do not make them feel that you ha they have to spend they are all waking hours with you you do they like the that like that you understand that it is important to have space as well space is what makes your heart for like beat more for each other space is what helps you miss each other understand each other it's not something where you both are can always together and getting on each other's nerves or trying to be more very demanding and trying to be unrealist and uh, having unrealistic expectations from each other so as you both are not this way you both appreciate that about each other and you don't claim you don't claim each other or you don't try to you know own each other you're just there together as beautiful partners who who are allowing each other to be yourself and who believes in equal give and take so this is a beautiful partnership a beautiful connection and your future spouse cannot be more proud of it let's see more information so that we can understand how they will express their feelings about this first thing i noticed about this card is that you both are more of a silent people like um you let your physical touch do the talking or you let you or you just like to cuddle or stay close and not much of you know actual talking so that is what i sense over here even you both might be or at least one of you might be a meditator more silent more feeling less talking that is what i'm sensing over here oh so these two cards which are visible i'm going to take those so we have these very beautiful cards okay i'm getting a picture now i'm getting a beautiful picture i mean i need some more cards so that we can build up a story and uh, start telling how they are going to say this 
ओके ओह पावरफुल कार्ड्स हाँ टू टू मेजर आर कार्ड्स आउट ऑफ थ्री एंड द थर्ड कार्ड्स नोलस हम्म ओह वन मोर मेजर आर कार्ड ओके सो एस वी सेड यू बोथ डोंट मेक इच अदर फील लाइक बाउंडेड रिस्ट्रिक्टेड not claiming not trying to controlling that is not there you are actually giving each other as much freedom as you want or and actually sub being very supportive to each other there was something which disturbed either them or you in their in their past and that disturbance is actually that disturbance was needed that turned around their life or that heartbreak or whatever it was there was some tower moment in their life like they maybe they lost a job and uh, that that turned around their life and now they became self employed someone who can be their own boss have their own working hours work as they want live as they want travel the world be tra- work from anywhere they want so they did build this build business systematically and they believe that this is exactly how you get success in everything in your life they have faced something which was difficult which was hard but they do see this actually experience has g- given them a, a invaluable lesson this lesson has helped them build a new life a new life where they see a future with you so what they want to tell you is that thank you for ha- being so patient with me while i was growing from the knight to emperor thank you for being my support thank you for being that goal who i wanted to achieve not only my financial success not only the money not only this business but also you as my ultimate goal thank you for helping me when my life turned upside down thank you for being my constant support my loyal partner my the love of my life my friend my partner in crime my encouragement my muse the reason i wanted to be successful some the reason i wanted to have this business the reason for which i have this drive in me because seeing you having everything makes me happy seeing you in a good place seeing you in a very luxurious environment makes me happy everything i do i do it for you this is brian adams song which i just heard so if you have not heard the song oh my god why why this is a classic if you have not heard it yet just listen to it it's it's, it's a beautiful song everything i do i do it for you and that is exactly what this person is saying as well so when they say this when they express their feelings to you they are going you will already know what they feel obviously because you ha- you are there in this journey with them you are being their support you are being their partner maybe you will actually be their business partner or a friend or someone who knows their story and is uh, v- rooting for them yes you can do it yes you will win yes you will this will be a success uh, yes this is going to work so you saw them going through a difficult phase you saw them turning their life around and they take your support as a lucky charm as well not only as an encouragement not only as something which they would value and cherish but also as a lucky charm they have this fierce loyal attitude towards the, towards you they want to have a family with you because the emperor is already a father figure plus we see a child in the 10 of pentacles as well so they definitely want to have a family with you if that is what you want as well and they want to grow old with you we can see old person in 10 of pentacles as well so they want to grow old with you as well they want to live a luxurious beautiful life with you so that is what their feelings are they don't want to feel like this any never they want to feel like this you help them come out of this place where they felt like they were stuck in uh, unfavorable situation where they were stuck where they didn't like it they felt bounded they felt like uh, they couldn't move from here nothing would work out in their life so something was not in their favor and you helped them 
get the tower moment and the song everything i do i do it for you is perfect for you your pal so it's a bran adam song i i will try to put a link in the description do check it out normally songs don't come up so easily but this time the song did come up so maybe this is a message for specific someone if the song already has a connection in your relationship then you know who we are talking about and this is a very beautiful message that this person absolutely treats you like someone they want to cherish and have a partner for life they do see you as a partner for life and that is what they are going to ex that is what they are going to say when they will uh, express their feelings for you let's go for some oracle cards to get more information and then we'll go to our favorite love notes okay let's see ah uh, cancer let your fears dissolve so yes they did had to face some fears when the situations were not in favor uh, there was something which uh, made them feel uneasy but uh, you helped them let their fa fears dissolve you helped them feel better and you are like this beautiful full moon beautiful sh light in their life like their life was dark before like dark over here before you stepped in you are like a light you are like this precious beautiful full moon for them they absolutely love everything about you even if you have something which you are conscious about like you don't like some part of you like, i know most of us have this feeling that my this is not perfect my that is not perfect if only i can improve this if only i can improve that i'm talking about looks over here that suppose you if you are someone who has uh, feelings like i don't have this perfect my skin is not perfect or my um my i don't i'm not at my ideal weight or i'm not um educated enough or smart enough whatever your whatever your feelings are or whatever your doubts are about yourself they find your imperfections beautiful actually they don't see that as anything which is lacking you as a whole they just love like we love a full moon we don't look at the patches or whatever we can see on the full moon we lo love full moon as it is as a whole and they exactly love you as you are as a whole they are not they don't even see those imperfections which you consider as imperfection they are in love with you the way you are they don't want to change you in any way possible they they don't even want to talk about it they just love you the way you are and they want your presence in their life no matter what let your fears dissolve so yes you help them let their fear dissolve and there the cancer is some uh, cancer sign also might be or the cancer season might be important for you okay so the cancer season is june july so uh, see if you and even the beach something related to beach I think in last reading also beach was coming up for sure. Let's see what more message comes up. Ah, full moon again. Yes, you you are their moon. You are you are absolutely someone who they cherish like a moon lover will look at a moon like a wolf will howl at moon. They absolutely love you. Like the you you are their full moon. You are their everything. Like the the most beautiful. thing in the world that is what you are the light of a full moon how it feels like if you are someone who loves to watch the full moon then you will know what this feeling is because i absolutely fall in love with full moon every full moon i absolutely look at it like a some supernatural phenomenal phenomenal going on i just look at it like it's breathtakingly beautiful and that is how this person will look at you or that is how this person will feel about you even if they and they can't put it into words that is what their feelings are find a balance so you help them find a balance libra sign or libra season is also important for you so libra season is august september right that is what libra is um no september october my mistake sorry september october and uh, you are being called you, you and they are saying thank you to you to help them find a balance so they were struggling they were not uh, happy how their life was and you help them become more disciplined or help them find the right path or help them stay motivated somehow whatever you did help them reach their goal reach their target help them improve their situation whatever went wrong turn their life around for the, for good so that is why you are like a light to them a full moon light like how a full moon can help in on a 
when if suppose you are walking outside where there is no street light but the full moon is there it will be very easy to see right it will be very very easy to see it you won't have, you won't miss street lights over there that is exactly how they feel like you have lightened their path you have helped them see when everything else was dark you have given them some ray of hope some hope which put them in the right path you help them find balance in their life you help them dissolve their fears and they will talk about all this when they talk with you divination so you might be into divination that is why they consider you as someone who's a light worker or someone who can show path someone who can help them or a spiritual person like you don't have to be a tarot reader to uh, be into divination you 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 might even be a spiritual person so what what they feel is that whatever your beliefs are that help them to as well embrace your powers of divination which are especially strong right now you have the ability to see your current situation with crystal clear clarity so you have clarity you have the clarity you have the wisdom you have the knowledge which is helping them see their path as well which is helping them find their best solution or find balance or find their right path as well so they do respect this knowledge the spirituality which you have focus your mind thank you angels for helping me to focus on my priorities that is exactly what you did you help them focus on their priorities you help them not get overwhelmed with whatever went wrong you help them not get overwhelmed with the fear but you help them make a plan you help them focus on their priorities you help them find the right path that what can help them exactly become successful and one step at a time they could solve all these problems and reach a, a place where they are very happy to and proud to be and now they want to pamper you cherish you and love you and respect you for all that you have done for them lord shiva transcendence rise up honor your inner force steps are being given dance with the universe so lord shiva also has this beautiful moon on their head and lord shiva is definitely definitely has a beautiful connection with moon so we do see this moon like they do see you as light they do see you as someone who's very positive as uh, someone who will guide them as someone who will also cool them like when they are feeling overwhelmed cool them cool them so that they feel calm cool collected and they can take the right decision someone who can help them see cl clearly like not only what is actually there but what can be and someone who will help them create their own universe create their own world like lord shiva created the world with the use of his drum same way they will help you uh, you are helping them create their own world and that is why they are, they can't be more grateful for that they are ready to dance on your tunes because they know that you are taking them where they want to be or you are the exact person like they consider you as a teacher actually even if they don't say it into words they do look up to your spiritual knowledge and the snake over here tells me that you help them shed the shed their past shed their skin which was not needed anymore so you help them overcome that fear that past whatever trauma whatever they had whatever issues they had in the past which was not helping them you had them you help them overcome that and um, praying to lord shiva or chanting om mantras or meditating with om mantras um this all will help you find your divine masculine if you are in a search of your divine masculine because lord shiva is the divine masculine so you can pray to lord shiva even if you are looking for a divine feminine you can still pray to lord shiva it's not like you only have to pray when you are looking for divine masculine even when you are looking for divine feminine you can still pray to lord shiva i said divine masculine first because lord shiva is the divine masculine so that also message if it resonates with you you can take it so we have a feather over your guardian angel so you already have angelic presence in or they call you as their angel they literally call i heard that they call you as that my angel my angel my love my beloved however they will call you they will they will have like multiple nicknames for you and they will call you their your your their angel you are not alone so you have this presence of spiritual spiritual team with you 
this angelic team the spirit guides with you the divine is present with you and they do sense that they do see sense that you are way powerful than uh, anyone else they know and they respect that and they cherish that they value that even if they don't understand that they do value that for sure and feathers is also a sign if maybe when you see a lot of feathers you will know that this person is nearby or this person is going to enter your life soon or this person is going to uh, express their feelings for you soon feathers might be a sign your spirit guides angels are using to communicate with you white feather especially and the third eye is third eye is very prominent in your reading so i hope you are into meditation and if you are not please start because lord shiva is a meditator and the third eye is very really really prominent in your reading birth be receptive to a new idea child or situation number 2 so you should check pile number 2 as well i have not done that yet but uh, maybe there is a message for you or number 2 is important for you and um, the second month also might be important for you uh, february or two months from now something important is going to happen and uh, there, there is a birth of something new which i assume is a business because that is what we can what i saw over here that you help them establish a business so maybe uh, they had an idea and you help them take it further so some business something you help them uh, create some maybe a something a creative project some project they did work on which which you help them you help them schedule you help them bring into reality okay let's go for some what is this dex name i never remember this dex name heart oracle sacred heart oracle i guess i have to search for this one's box the box i've kept it somewhere wait a minute i will see what more messages pile number 1 wants to needs to know about this beautiful connection friendship okay so you and this person might be friends first and that is and you help them uh, start their business you help them as a friend and they definitely consider you as a more than a friend so if you are you know this person as a friend maybe they want to come out and uh, like tell you like they want to make sh make sure that their feelings are expressed they want to tell you that they consider you as a more than a friend and they don't want to only be friend with, friends with you anymore nurture the bonds of friendship within your relationship and your love life will dramatically improve so yes they absolutely absolutely love and adore you and they want to keep you safe and protected that is exactly how they want to do they want to make sure that you're safe protected you're guarded they think that you are that rare gem who needs to be guarded you are someone so amazing and um, so pure and like an angel and they want to just keep you away from everything else or all the whole world they want to save you they want to like even i'm not saying that you any kind of danger but they are overprotective over you they want to make sure that you are cherished and valued and treated like maybe royalty or treated like a princess or something like that like treated with high respect everywhere that is what they feel for you wow and they do have this beautiful friendship with you and they don't want to even when you're in a relationship even when you get married they don't want this friendship to end at all they always want to be your best friend okay let's see the what romance angels have to say now we know that you already have strong angelic presence around you then we'll go for love notes i don't want to forget love notes in any pile today oh god that was unfortunate that i oh yeah true love for sure oh wow this is true love for sure this is romance of a lifetime yes it is true love for sure we have no doubt about it and as as we already mentioned there is there is angels present around you or around this person like the angels are trying to make this relationship work finances and career yes 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 you did help them with their career you did help them with their finances something related to a business or a project where where they went from a difficult financial position to a, to a far better financial position so somehow or maybe you work together and they are like a work friend 
they are like a uh, like a co-worker you really have a beautiful connection with you're very friendly with so maybe that is what it is so somehow you are related to with uh, related to each other with work even if you were friends from a long time then again uh, later on you started working together or you started a business together or um, you work in a field where you can support each other or you're each other's clients somehow finances career work is associated with your relationship financial issues are a factor in your love life right now or if this person is not coming forward maybe they are going through that financial uh, difficult phase right now which they are yet to overcome don't worry they will overcome that and they want to make sure that they overcome that and then they will come and approach you then they will express their feelings for you calling in your soulmate you might be someone who's already using all your divination skills your talents your spiritual skills to call in your soulmate you might be do making doing prayers affirmations visualizations you might be um, calling your angels for help to bring you together you might be doing all that and let your friends help you ask for and accept support from others so you are being told that your friends actually are going to help you bring come together maybe you are, you both belong to a, a community a group a group of friends and your friends and their friends are, you have some common friends will help you come together or maybe your uh, they have uh, expressed their feelings to their friends and that friend can tell you that you know this person is in love with you something like that so there is some kind of something from a friend who will help you come together like of your friends might help make this connection actually happen maybe they are feeling um not that confident to approach you directly and they'll take a help of a friend maybe that is what is happening let's see now love notes what what how will they say or what will they say when they actually start talking about it this person respects you a lot and th this person doesn't want to lose you even as a friend okay i'll have to pick that up where did it go yeah found it i put it back because um, i'm not sure if that was the message I love watching rom-coms with you. I love when your face light lights up because of those movies. That tiny moments with you is how we are creating our love story better than rom-coms. So yeah, this might be the friend you watch rom-coms with. This might be the f uh, the colleague uh, you talk about what you saw last night or or what are you watching currently. Uh, you know this is new. This new show came up or this new movies. a uh, new movie is going to be released so you this might be that colleague or that friend and um, they and maybe they, this person is not actually interested in those movies and those romcom shows and all but because of your interest they do participate in that or they do like to watch it with you or they do like to stay updated about that so that they can discuss with you i have fallen for you and i can't get up i don't even want to yes this person has definitely fallen for you attraction you are manifesting this love law of attraction yes we did see this this is a confirmation so you might be doing some manifestation work and it is coming for you and it is happening for sure it is working that whatever you're doing is working loving you is like a full time job and i love it yes i do think that you might be working together like um, maybe they love being in that full time job because they get to see you or they are just saying that that it is like a full time job but i love it i love everything you do i love everything you say i'm crazy for you okay this person is head over heels i know i will see you at home but i can't m help missing you at work so if if you are not working with them then this is the other message we have both energy so for some of you the work will uh, resonate for some of you the not working together will resonate so take it as you as it resonates with you aquarius flexible open minded free spirited let go of fixed ideas to bring love in so one of you might have aquarius in their sun moon or rising and you're being called to let go of the fixed ideas and be open Uh, if you are using LOA, don't have any restrictions. Let it 
let it flow in uh, in whatever form it wants to flow in it might surprise you you are my dream come true my dream come true yes beautiful i can't wait until i can roll over at 2 am to find your lips instead of a text long distance living separately is hard now this does not have to be long, long distance does not have to be another city another state another country it can also be that you both live in the same city work in the same office but still you as you are not in the same house as you are not in the same place together they still feel find this hard living separately like you're living separately and it is hard for them and they want to change this as soon as possible they want to be with you as soon as possible uh, so these are the love notes for you pal number 1 i hope you enjoyed the reading thank you again for being here i'll see you in my next one pal number 2 so in today's reading we are going to do your future spouse how will they express their feelings for you i'm i'm uh, feeling a bit under the cold i have a Oh, sorry under the weather i have cold and uh, because of that my voice is uh, sounding different i'm actually completely clogged up um, that is why i'm not, i had difficulty making the video on time uh, but i hope this will give you the right messages uh, what happened in my last uh, video was i forgot to add love notes in the third pile and it was because the pile was extremely emotional very sweet very romantic and it just skipped my mind um uh, i got carried away by with the reading so so i decided to make one more uh, pick a card with love notes so that whoever missed out on it can uh, enjoy the love notes because even i love the love notes and i hope you get the right messages and you can take this as a continuation from the last video or it can be a brand new video you can you don't have to stick to the same pile you can go for multiple piles as well so let's see how will they express their feelings for you we have this beautiful card over here this card it represents lots of ups and downs lots of um it also shows us that how even when things don't work uh, the way they're supposed to work even, even when there are moments when you feel helpless you both have each other's support so no matter what goes down what goes up no matter what kind of situation life is putting in you into you both embrace each other you both support each other you both are there to be that rock for each other now let's see trust yes you both trust each other blindly transformation occurs through acceptance once you accept the current situation it will automatically transform so wow this is a beautiful card isn't it so you, there is there is trust and there is transformation as well so you trust each other you trust in the divine you trust in the universe you trust in the divine timing and you both are helping to transform each other from past past traumas from whatever went wrong from whatever um, was not healing you are helping each other to heal that if you were not able to heal it on your own with this person support you are able to heal that so let's see how will they express their feelings for you I hope you enjoyed the last reading with which was what they think about you their thoughts about you now we are going to see what will they actually say to you let's see what will pal number 2's future spouse say to pal number 2 how will they express their feelings what exactly are they going to say how will they express their feelings and yeah we will include love notes at the end of the reading first tarot then oracle then love notes that is how we do it let's see how will they express their feelings pal number 2's future spouse how will they express their feelings how will they okay didn't come out this thing came out okay yeah you both or at least one of you went through a heartbreak and that is that was something which was difficult to heal and that is why we can see that you know they you suppose you went through a heartbreak or this person you need someone you can trust you need someone you can hold on to you need someone who can comfort you so that is why yes that is what we are seeing over here after the heartbreak after the difficulty your person is saying my love i went through hell and i thought that i would never find peace and happiness but you came into my life inspiring me to work on myself inspiring me to get over the past i can easily look away from the dark clouds because you are the ray of sunshine i was praying for you are that raging fire which creates the kind of passion which i never experienced in my life before you made you are you make me feel 
feelings which people only write novels about i am completely completely head over heels crazy for you i'm so attracted towards you and i'm highly highly aroused even when i'm near you you drive me crazy baby you just drive me crazy so these were what the what came up right now oh yeah this person turned from someone who had walls built up that it, this person is never going to fall in love never going to trust anyone else but you came in their life and shook that all away and you turned this person from this walls built up to someone extremely sweet romantic poetic we already saw a glimpse of that so this person be- became the knight of cups for you this now this person does not have to be for a water sign it can be like he's a he, he or she is a fire sign or a water sign but they turned into this knight of cups is extremely sweet very romantic very creative so if this person sings they sing for you if the person writes they write for you if the person sketches they do that for you if the person likes to go on long drives they they want you by their side so whatever this person enjoys doing they want to do it with you even if it is something you enjoy doing and this person has no idea what what it is about for example, example tarot tarot spirituality and you're very much into it and this person has no idea about it at all has never even seen tarot cards but if if you're talking about it this person is all yours this person is okay i want to know yes i want to understand okay what what is a fire sign okay okay that is a fire sign fine uh, it's good wow okay and so whatever you will tell them they want to know more they want to understand more they want to understand you better they are fascinated by everything you say to them so this is how this person turned into the king of cups because of you and they are highly 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 attracted towards you they cannot even sleep because of you they are saying that my world um my world because the world card keeper my love you are my world i can't sleep i can't stop thinking about you i can't concentrate on my work i'm going crazy i know your world apart maybe there is a distance between you and this person even if it is not like a huge distance even if it is not actual world apart maybe you you live in different country uh, sorry different cities but still this person feels that there is a distance of world apart so they say i know your world apart and i can i i just keep on dreaming that i will run towards you i will come towards you i will just be with you i just want to be with you i don't i don't like sleeping on my own i don't like being in my bed on my own i want you i really really want you right next to me that is what this person thinks about and they go they're completing this cycle of pain toxic toxic or whatever went through the past they are releasing it the world completion they are releasing they're getting released from it because now they see hope they didn't do any work because they were least bothered about anything but since they saw you met you since they um, had a connection with you or had a talk with you they start they want to complete this cycle they want to end this pain so that they can focus on new yes this person has highly highly seductive thoughts about you or highly physical thoughts about you this person is uh, finds you extremely attractive like if, if you you sometimes it will make you feel like are you sure you're so attracted towards me what's so special about me i never nobody ever said that to me or uh, i don't understand how can i drive you so crazy from so far away but this person will tell you why they find you attractive why they find you peaceful why they feel like everything they went through was worth it because they found, they now can be with you or they now found you they find you inspirational they find you someone who can give them hope for new new ideas they find they find you uh, uh, like freedom in their old relationship they felt bonded they felt like no, nothing will go their way they felt like they had to be in some place where they were not happy but with you they are free they are carefree they are happy they are they are like a free spirit they are like a bird flying they they are they enjoy their life with you they are really they feel genuine happiness with you and the peace you bring to their soul 
the healing they bring to their, their heart is something they find very attractive and the and the way they uh, think about you is actually because they want you in their life and they when they think about they want you in their life they want you in, in with them they also start thinking about your personal moments how will you be when you will actually be together what exactly will you do this person does have a lot to overcome actually and you if you are spiritually um, i do feel that you are more spiritually awakened than this person so you will help them overcome this this person might even have capricorn in their sun moon rising now let's see the signs over here we have capricorn we have scorpio we have pisces we have taurus we have uh, aquarius um, leo sagittarius aries these are the signs which we have over here so this person might have any of these signs or um, you also have them in your birth chart and i'm seeing that this person absolutely felt bounded or felt like they were not treated well or they didn't um, or they were they were not in a right connection they didn't feel that passion they didn't feel that pull towards their past person that it was a karmic relationship it was a it was a heavy relationship they were not happy over there and now they are looking for someone who makes their life full, full feel fulfilled who makes them feel very happy who makes them feel like a free spirit who makes them feel like they can be anything they want to be they can do anything they want to do they want they see you as a partner who will help them build their life not as someone who will tear them down they don't see compromise when they are with you they see only happiness they see only support they see only trust that is what they see they see friendship they see love and this these all qualities which bring which actually brings peace to their mind these are emotional qualities is something which they consider seductive not the appearance not the uh, not how you look not how you dress not how you smell not um, the way you talk or walk or anything those all things is not something which is important for this person the feelings they feel when they think about you or when they talk to you how how you make them feel how 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 much comfort you bring to their heart that is what they find extremely seductive they are, they find your emotional maturity your emotional balance very very seductive that is because they absolutely miss that in their old relationship and now they look at you and they feel that this is exactly what i missed and i want this i need this i really really desire this that is the exact feelings for you now let's go for some oracle cards then we will go for some love notes where we will get more information but i am feeling a very highly sexual uh, connection over you and it is coming because of emotional actually attraction not physical attraction some people are attracted towards intelligence some people are attracted towards emotional uh, comfort some people are attracted towards financial comfort so it's it's different for everyone not everyone is only concerned about the physical appearance it's different for everyone people are not even aware of it they just see someone and they are attracted towards them and you will and uh, they won't be able to explain that why they are attracted but but this person finds your emotional intelligence your emotional knowledge extremely extremely seductive very very attractive they find peace with you like they consider you as their peace they consider you as their world they consider you as their happiness honor your feelings yes you honor their feelings you don't make them feel bad for whatever they are feeling in the last relationship they were not given this opportunity to show their feelings they were uh, ridiculed to show when they tried to show their feelings their feelings were did were not considered in the last relationship and you honor their feelings so that that is why they feel so at peace this card it is all about peace how this how beautiful how tranquil in this water is how beautiful this color is exactly this is the kind of effect you have on the on them peace serenity calm happiness soothing that is what they f they feel when they are talking with you or even when they look at your picture virgo pisces and virgo 
take inspired action full moon in virgo so you're being told called to take inspired action so whatever you whatever you're being inspired to do if when you start doing that when you follow your heart you will see that things fall in place in the exact way and this person is also waiting to get that inspiration or that ac acknowledgement or permission to take a move towards you to move towards you and they are they can't wait to be in your life they just want to be with you so we got additional signs over here let's see what more the oracles have to say then we are going for our beautiful love notes okay ask for help so this person might approach you when they are trying to help like this person might be uh, maybe you are friends or you dated in the past or um, you know each other for some like uh, through work or some some way and they ask they come to you for help or they or maybe you ask them for some some help and that is how you connect and this is also a card where you can ask where, where you're getting the permission from the angels to ask for help angels love to support us angel loves to help us but what happens is we are always blocked we never invite them in angels are supposed to be invited in so you can pray to any angel you believe in or you can just pray in angel pray to angels in general and ask for their help so that you can get help regarding this situation angels are celestial beings who protect everyone and the fairies say now is the time for you to ask for angelic assistance so if you think that there is a difficult situation you should definitely ask for angelic assistance and you will be amazed how beautifully it gets resolved i've done that many many times and it always worked out Ah, peace. We did talk about that, right? This is exactly what they they see you as: peace and harmony. They see you as harmony. They see you as bliss. They see you as ultimate happiness. They see you as someone who brings calm in their life, who brings peace in their life. Peace and harmony. Archangel Raguel, thank you, Raguel, for surrounding my life with a with life in a harmonious light. So yes, that is exactly what they see you as: peace and harmony. inner strength move back to wholeness recognize that you have the power so you help them move back to wholeness this is completion this is wholeness so you help them move back towards their to to get back their power leo is showing up again over here we saw leo in the world card as well so you are becoming their inner strength or you're guiding them to uh, channel their inner strength to connect with their inner strength and that is why they will always respect you and they will always keep you up on a pedestal and they will always treat you like someone um, who deserves to be honored loved cherished because you help them recognize their inner strength let's see what more okay arrow surround yourself with protective energy so yeah this person is going to be highly protective of you very very protective of you this person also might be into a career where uh, where they have to be protective maybe even use weapons uh, or maybe they might be uh, someone who uses fire like a cook like a chef um, or like a like a scientist the 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 scientist who work with uh, chemicals and fire and all so they might be someone who even uses fire in their work or weapons um so their their work feels bit stressful as well and that is why they value the peace and the calm you bring in their life the happiness they you bring in their life so because of the the stress or because of the uh, difficult path they have chosen uh, as a career is something where um it's very rare for them to find this beautiful peace and that is what you bring in their life that is why you are someone who they consider as unmatched who they consider as um someone they can never forget someone they can never get over and uh, they will be very protective of you and your connection highly protective arrow and they cannot wait to come to, towards you and arrow also reminds me of sagittarius so yes this person might even have sagittarius we already saw that with the ace of wands but this is another confirmation that sagittarius sign is also showing up 
openings a new door is opening for you so yes they are just waiting for this new opening this new chance the path is they already know the path they they are bounded now right now they they are looking for this key this key and the universe will help them look at the number 22 2 Two, 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 two is the number of union. So yes, the universe, the divine angels will help them find this key, which will be their solution, which will be their way towards you, which will help them come out of this whatever wherever they are stuck, and which will help them find you. Also, they look at you as a unicorn. They look at you as an angel, an earth angel, a unicorn, someone who is. not normal not i'm i'm not saying up normal someone who's not ordinary but extraordinary someone who's amazing someone who they absolutely love and adore and they are always very inspired to know to know things from you something which they never even thought about and this new opening will open up for them this number the angel number 222 is a confirmation that your union is definitely going to happen no matter how difficult it looks right now the universe the angels has has their way to make things happen to bring things into reality to help you connect so there's nothing to worry about even if things feel difficult they will definitely find solution wisdom they consider you as extremely wise they consider you as someone who maybe because of your spiritual knowledge your emotional knowledge um they they consider you as someone who has these hidden knowledges or who has these amazing information which they never even discussed with someone before you and they absolutely love this and they are they are in awe by the wisdom you have and they want to put this crown on your head they want to treat you like a queen they want to treat you like an empress they want to make you feel or an or an emperor or a king whatever gender you are interested in they want to make you feel celebrated they want to make you feel cherished so they are absolutely amazed by the wisdom like when you are talking with them and they you just say something which makes them feel wow that's amazing they when when they talk with you they feel like they are talking to a therapist they feel like they are talking to someone they can um they can trust and unburden their whatever difficulty whatever pain they are they are in they feel relief when they talk with you you really help them feel better you are like their unpaid therapist or maybe a paid therapist maybe this is a client with whom you start uh, uh, having a relationship with later on maybe you met them through uh, your profession act within with wisdom and people will respect you and what and they have this high respect for you for sure they definitely have a high respect for you for sure and someone might be a chief as well like a high authority position we see a chief over here we see followers over here so someone might be at a high authority position in whatever career they are in so they might have a good title a good position some high authority like a chief over here we can see Uh, and they might belong to an ancient culture also we can see native americans over here they might belong to an ancient culture also that will also help you recognize this person i'm also seeing scotland over here i'm also seeing switzerland i'm also seeing bali uh, thailand uh, thailand area asia sri lanka uh, England Scotland that side that part of Europe um, North America Yeah if anything else comes up I'll I'll definitely inform or say that now let's go for love notes love notes is the is the like cherry on the top I really love these Okay these two want to come out let's see we fit together like puzzle pieces i love finding that out again and again so if you have been intimate with this person then this is the message that they feel that they keep on thinking about those moments or this is something which is yet to happen but when it happens they will always always in uh, keep on remembering those moments and keep on um feeling good about what whatever happened can't get you out of my mind yes trust me i tried i need to work yes they can't get over you they can't even sleep they are constantly think constantly thinking about you maybe you are feeling the same about this person as well my mind is dirty and you are all over it making it dirtier yes you are making them think think thoughts which they did which they 
were not with for a long time they never even thought about such thoughts you're making everything feel feel like uh, everything come up in a very different way for them they have never experienced this before or for a long time they have not experienced something like this okay i love reading history from all my research i can safely say that you are my favorite person of all time so this person might be someone who has traveled a lot who has um, seen a lot who understands a lot who handles a uh, lot of things like uh, who handles um, business um, all over the world or who works in a, in a place where you know his historical knowledge is also important or might be a history professor or something like that so this person has done a lot of studies for work or uh, just because they enjoy it and they think that you are, you as a person is the gem you as a person is the best person in the world I am so lucky to fall in love with my best friend and this person and you are good friends as well. So either this is a friend of yours and then you become lovers or this is someone you meet, you fall in love with and then you understand how beautiful friendship you can have with this person as well. That it is not only about love but also a friendship. Wo promise commitment marriage. So that is what is on their mind. They want this with you, a, a committed relationship, marriage, that is what they want. you changed my life for better yes they you did pull them out of that difficult phase of that uh, phase where you were they felt very very uh, helpless they felt stuck you did pull them out of that difficult phase embrace change transform move relocate so you or this person or both of you will relocate to live together to come together divine timing yes it's all about timing neither this person can do anything neither you can do anything it's all about divine timing it will be worth the wait pure love this is pure love for sure and it will be worth the wait divine timing trust the divine trust the divine timing keep calm keep patient so have some patience this person and you will be together you will relocate you will you will transform each other's life you will move to be together you will be in a beautiful marriage commitment uh, if you are not interested in marriage then a beautiful committed relationship and you your both life are going to be changed for better just have some patience and believe in divine timing let me let let us go for more three love notes because why not uh, yeah i'm enjoying this let's go for more three love notes. travel yes vacation retreat work assignment holiday maybe this person works uh, travels a lot because of work or they want to travel if what wherever they went or whatever they like they want to take you there they want to go on vacations and holidays with you maybe something to look forward when you are together okay you make it ha- you make it kind of hard not to stare yep they are completely head over heels crazy about you okay I know you love rom-coms but our love story is my favorite. Oh, your love story when you tell your love story to someone, they might literally say that to you that it's like a novel, it's like a rom-com, it's like a K-drama, it's like a webtoon, it's like a it's like a hall hall what is that? Hallmark movie. So it's like a Disney movie. So someone might literally say that that your story is just like a rom com it's so beautiful so when you share your story with someone that is that's the kind of feedback you will get so if you already got the, this kind of feedback you know who what we are talking about over here so this is what i have for you panel number 2 i hope you enjoyed the reading i'm really sorry i'm feeling a bit low because of my cold but i'm trying my best to give you the best messages uh, i hope you enjoyed the reading thank you again i'll see you in my next one Sorry pile number 2 I forgot to do the uh, some more oracle cards the romance oracle cards I forgot to de- do them I have to do them I can't ignore these these are the these are important in a love reading so that is why I started this video again for you guys I hope this will give you additional messages as I said I'm not feeling well so that is why I'm not able to concentrate but let's see what is happening over here what messages are coming for you for you pile number 
twin flame your passion ignites yes very extremely passionate connection this connection it will drive you and this person crazy when you're together it's going to be highly passionate and the divine angels whoever you believe in is helping you come together we also see twin flames and twins like gemini energy so one of you might have gemini in their birth chart and i do see this divine connection the or divine intervention in your relationship twin flames your passion ignites beautiful very extremely passionate connection will drive each other crazy okay that didn't want it to come whichever wants to come out i'll only take that sacred union honor and treasure your relationship for it's truly sacred yes yes this is a sacred union like this is the divine bringing you together this is beautiful connection this is a this is a hundred percent sacred pure divine connection divine bliss and you are going to be together for sure the union will happen no matter how impossible it looks how difficult it feels you, and the best part over this uh, about this card is that it clearly says honor and treasure that is exactly how they will treat your relationship and hopefully you will as well that you will honor and treasure this relationship and you will realize that how sacred how beautiful how valuable this connection is it's not your regular connection oh we've also got soulmate for you so we have twin flame and soulmate yes this is your soulmate so whoever you're thinking about is your soulmate for sure oh beautiful and there is going to be a wedding so whatever the doubt was that maybe this is never going to happen because of some difficulties it there there will be a wedding for sure and so there is nothing to worry about congratulations pile number two forgiving and learning as you release and heal the past you experience more love in your present moment so maybe this is what you will teach them forgiving do we need one more do we need one more do we need one more give your relationship a chance work on your partnership so even if things don't look good right now give it a chance work on it uh, have some patience and things will start making sense very very soon i'm really sorry for missing this part of the reading but i hope you got it thank you again i'll see you in my next one pile number three so in today's reading we are going to see future spouses express how will they express their feelings for you how will your future spouse express their feelings for you that is the topic of today's reading uh in the last reading uh, unfortunately it it was a love notes reading where i missed uh, reading the love notes for your pile pile number three i'm really sorry the reading was so emotional and so sweet uh, i just got carried away and uh, it completely skipped my mind i'm really i'm really really sorry about that so i um, decided to make one more reading with love notes and this is like a continuation but you don't have to stick the same pile you can pick uh, any other pile you can pick multiple piles as well whatever resonates with you whatever feels right for to you so i hope you will enjoy the reading this last reading was the thoughts about you this reading is how will they express their feelings for you so let's see you have this beautiful card it talks about embrace through each other you find the missing pieces wow so that is what you do you complete each other you fulfill each other you feel good you feel at peace the, your embrace is healing this hug or this coming close close or this um, you know embracing this being closer that is what you need to heal that is what you need to feel good so that is what i'm seeing now we are going to go through tar tarot first then oracle cards and then love notes to see how will they express their feelings for you what are they going to say how are they going to say it what are their intention what is happening oh yeah similar to pile two. yeah similar to pile two i'm i'm sensing that this is a bit similar to pile two does not have to be you can pick whatever pile you're comfortable with and if it doesn't suit you you don't have to stick with that messages at all these messages are general they are not for like someone specific so not every message will suit you uh, okay we already have two major arcanas and night and we have two nights as well night and major arcanas we also have a page so your person felt stuck your person felt bounded actually your person is not stuck for good uh, they are actually thinking about things or they are feeling like they cannot get over this hurdle for some reason emotional reason 
maybe because of the upbringing maybe because uh, other people are involved so there is some reason that they feel stuck and they are not able to come towards you they want to come towards you for sure that is what they are manifesting even if they don't understand what manifestation is that is what they are trying to bring in their life or that is what they are praying for many people who don't actually believe in law of attraction or don't believe or don't understand law of attraction they do know that you can pray for something to whoever you believe in and this person might be doing that this person might be calling out to whoever they believe in whatever god they worship that i need your help to come out of this situation and to move towards my true love that is what this person is doing so this person is stuck somewhere due to maybe their work or maybe some other commitment or maybe some other reason whatever this family issues or some reason is there where they are not actually stuck for good they can leave but they are having they will take some time to understand this or to realize the how to come out of it or to get the right path or right way and they are praying for that they are begging universe or god or whoever they believe in to please help me find the way please help me move out of here so they are trying to get make you understand that they that that their intention is they cannot wait to come towards you they have this beautiful cup for you and they want to want you to have it or they want you in their life but for some reason they are not able to do it right now but they are trying to put everything down whatever they have their pentacle their whatever their thoughts their cup everything they are putting down in front of the universe in front of divine and offering it to the divine and saying i'm ready to give up everything for this love i'm ready to give up any everything and anything but please help me be with my love so that is what this person is currently going through maybe they are not able to say this all to you but that is what they are doing so this person is looking for new ideas now the swords over here is a uh, page of swords is about new ideas curiosity they are curious how they can come out of this situation they are they have this thirst for knowledge they are looking for new ways to come out they are looking for new Uh, openings opportunities and they're waiting for this tower moment they're waiting for this whatever their whatever their foundation is they're waiting for it to crumble down completely the old foundation they can't wait this they can't wait f- uh, for this to oh, get over like they want it to ca- come down i'm sorry i'm uh, having a bit of cold that is why i'm not able to speak clearly um, i'm really sorry i can't help it i'm trying to do my best over here uh, so the tower over here talks about change now they want now this is a complete change like they want this foundation to be completely broken they don't want a small change they want a big massive change so complete change that is what they're looking for they are looking to completely change their chapter whatever this foundation is this foundation they want to break f- for good they don't want to be here anymore that is what their intention is but they also don't want to do something which is which is too rash or which will create troubles for other people involved they this person has a heart of gold they absolutely care about everyone in their life and you are the only one who brings comfort to their heart you're the only one who brings peace to their heart and they f- want you because they are a giver a complete giver and they never met a someone who is as big of a giver or as generous as you are as and you both are equal equal when it comes to uh, loving each other when it comes to generosity when it comes to caring for each other you both are equal that is why we have two knights over here you both can equally be supportive loving caring and they never found anyone like you they have always only dealt with takers they are the giver and they always they they were they, they only dealt with takers till now someone they they were they have been keep uh, they have been emptying their cup for those who didn't actually deserve it and that is what frustrates them now but they still cannot just create this moment or create this tower moment because they care about people involved in this situation and now they want to take a very well thought uh, action towards you so they want to make sure that they uh, come towards you with a proper planning proper planning not something which is which will be like 
of past like like the uh, knight of swords or knight of wands would have come in speed without thinking without uh, making any plan and would have come and then this and then the, it would have been a disaster they don't want that at all they want to make sure that this chapter is completely closed and then they can come with you with a solid plan so that they don't have to go back when they are with you they don't want this to fail at all they want this to be like their one one wish which they want to they don't want to gamble on at, at all they wa- they value you a lot and they want to come towards you with a proper plan with making sure that whatever is holding them back does not pull them back does not affect them and your relationship they want to make sure that your relationship is completely clean beautiful the new start is a whole fresh start the tower is completely shattered broken so that they can build a new life with you so they that is why they are coming here with a lot of planning lot of thinking making sure that they don't you know, take any and they don't do any they don't make any decisions which they will regret on they want to be 100% clear when they come towards you they don't want to come with any doubts at all they have this very very serious feelings for you and they don't want to gamble on it that is what they are they are worried about that is what they are thinking about and this person might have leo virgo gemini um taurus capricorn cancer scorpio pisces in their sun moon or rising these are the signs which i can see over here let's see more information if we can get any any more information what about this tower moment please clarify the tower and um, also the eight of swords please clarify tower and eight of swords i need to know more about this clarify. yeah yeah they will be they will be extremely successful in whatever they they it might be it might feel very difficult right now it might feel impossible task right now for whatever reason but give it time give it time and they will come out of this successful now this is a victor over here this is after you know going through a battle this warrior went through a battle and came out as a victor so this is there is victory for sure for this person it will take time divine timing is at play over here but they will come out of this with um, a proper solution with a proper victory so i do see success for sure for whatever this moment whatever this problem is they will oh, whatever that obstacle is they will overcome that for sure and yes they will move towards you for sure now we can see that they are moving from uh, we have, we'll also see these two cards which were extra cards but we'll also see them they are moving from this uh, ba- whatever bad place they were in stormy water wherever they were not wherever they feel like they were locked in a tower they felt like they were they were bounded over here so they will move out of that bad energy towards you calm cool energy they were disturbed here and they're coming towards their peace they do consider you as their peace their happiness and they are moving towards you they they might even be children involved in this situation why that is why this person wants to make sure that they don't do any kind of um any mistakes when they are making this movement when they are making this transactions because this will affect the children so they want to make sure that they are very clear when they are doing this transaction so yes but that is happening 6 is an important number 6 has come twice for you also these extra cards came up 4 4 so 6 and 4 are important number the month of june the month of uh, april are important or the dates 6 6 or 6 or 4 might be important or even the number 10 might be important for you so i'm seeing four of cups and four of uh, four of pentacles over here and this both to- in this both cards we can see that the person is sitting calmly that the person is not move doing any movement so yes they are thinking about something their focus is completely on what they have to what they have to do what decisions they have to do who whoever might be involved in this situation and yes they are interested in this cup of love or this uh, this single cup which is calling them towards the towards uh, this new love but maybe this new love is you but they have to think about the past or they have to think about that situation where they are stuck in be it a uh, be it their family members be it uh, 
some work related situation or financial situation but they will find a solution for sure they will find a way to feel safe they will find a way to uh, feel protected they will find a way to control the situation which looks at out of control right now and 4 4 is about stability so right now they don't feel stable they're praying for stability they're praying for answer and they will find stability for sure and six is a soulmate so this person might be your this person is your soulmate and they will find stability in this situation for sure right now they are they are definitely praying for it let's see what the oracles have to say then we'll go to the love notes if this message is not resonating with you then please check other piles as well but this was a very specific message and I couldn't ignore that. Okay, go deeper. Yes, they'll have to go deeper to solve the problem. They cannot just um, think uh, like that is why we got the Knight of Pentacles who will go deeper, research it. They will have to go deeper. It might take some time. So you have been called to be patient. Scorpio, new moon. New moon is a very nice energy, new beginning. So yes, they are praying for a new beginning first quarter moon in Aquarius trust the universe yes you are being called to trust the universe the divine whoever you believe in and trust that this and trust in this person as well don't pressurize them don't make them feel suffocated or because it's not in their hand right now they cannot do anything right now there is something which needs to be resolved so don't pressurize them or else it will just create difficulty for them as well as for your connection Trust the universe, trust in the divine timing. Everything happens for a reason. The divine is at play over here. Let's see what the universe has to say, what the fairies have to say. Pure intention, yes, this person has absolute pure intention. They have a heart of gold. That is why they are not taking any harsh decisions because they, they want to make sure that, ev that everything falls for the highest good of all. That is what they are praying for. The fairy of manifestation will help you to use your wishes wisely, manifest your heart's desire with pure intention and for the highest good of all. So you are even being suggested to pray as well. Pray that everybody, everybody gets the good out of this, everybody, that uh, the decision which happens is the highest good of all. Everyone is happy with the decision. Pray, pray that everything works out in the favor of all. The fairy queen of light comes to shed love and light onto your current situation and to remind you that light can penetrate the darkness. So even if you're feeling like you're stuck in darkness right now, there is light at the end of the tunnel. There is nothing to worry about. How big the tunnel is that we don't know, but there is end, there is light at the end of the tunnel. T talk about light. The miracle of forgiveness, Archangel Jermail. Thank you, Jermail, for helping me understand the process of forgiveness. Yes, maybe this person or you will have to go through a process of forgiveness. We'll have to forgive each other, forgive yourself. Synchronicity. Thank you, angels. I trust your well-timed guide timed guidance and sign yes you might be seeing a lot of synchronicity you both have a beautiful yin and connection as well and unconditional love wow divine mother yes there is pure complete pure love between this person and you unconditional love divine mother thank you divine mother for helping me to give and receive the love i deserve yes you can obviously pay pray to uh, the divine mother as well for this or angels, archangels. Commander Ashtar, call to action. Take charge, lead by example, walk your talk. So there might be a title involved over here. So maybe you or your person might have a title. Like we have a commander over here. So some kind of title. So there might be like a doctor or a professor, a CEO, some kind of title. A military title so there might be a title involved and call to action so they will be called to action they will be they will be given command by the universe by the by the divine by whoever they are praying to by whoever you are praying to they will get that and they will take charge they will obviously walk their talk so they might be only talking right now that i'll do this i'll do that they will obviously walk that this is a person who keeps their word who walks their talk they have pure intentions. Ah, Lady Venus. You can pray to Lady Venus as well. This is a beautiful card which gives us hope again. So download and understanding. The truth is being revealed. Deep insights are coming from the heaven and the astral realm. We have two cards where the astral realm is shown. 
so yes this is a beautiful card and the uh, and you can write to lady venus or pray to lady venus and she will definitely help you resolve this problem she will help you find the solution which will be best for all highest good of all lady venus is pure love lady venus is the goddess of love marriage fertility so beauty so she will definitely help you in this situation so you can go pray to lady venus to help you find the best solution as well and if you're already doing that then the presence over here uh, tells you that yes she is listening to you yes she has she is uh, aware of your situation yes she is helping you so that's a good sign come a beautiful sign actually okay earth guardian one of you might be a earth sign we have aquarius and we have scorpio so now earth is uh, virgo taurus capricorn stay rooted and grounded so you are being told to stay put to not worry to not panic to not create trouble for yourself and this person everything is happening as per divine plan so stay put stay rooted stay grounded stay calm stay at peace everything will work out that is what you are being called, told to do and spring see your seeds go grow so we have lady venus who is the goddess of fertility and we have a rabbit over here who is the animal spirit of fertility so if you are and even we have the divine mother as well so if you are wishing or plan planning or hoping to have a kid have a child this is a very positive sign that yes you will have a child with this person if that is your prayer if that is what you want if that is what you are hoping for if not then this message is not for you and um, the spring time will be important for you so maybe next spring uh, or maybe whenever the spring is in your place this is the spring time will be important and rabbit also shows us luck uh, the easter time is also which is coming over here lavender is also something the color lavender which will bring or the scent perfume lavender um, will bring um, luck in your life for sure there is luck involved there is nothing to worry about don't worry about this situation things will be resolved rabbit also talks about being it it will happen faster than you think even if right now you feel that nothing is moving there is uh, with with rabbit there is speed so there will be faster for sure and uh, this person is very gentle is sweet is gentle you both calm each other down you both make each other gentler you both make each other feel better calmer because i'm getting a lot of gentle vibes over here with lady venus with mother over here divine mother with the rabbit over here with very sweet gentle soft cuddly vibes there's no no harsh even if this person might be someone who is uh, from a from a difficult job they 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 are still very sweet calm grounded and with you and the and they really want to build up a life with you like they want to put down their roots with you that is what they want so let's go for some romance oracles and then we'll go for the love notes in pile number 2 i almost forgot the romance oracles i had to go back after the love notes and add this to the pile romance cupid arrows cupid's arrow strikes so yes cupid or divine oh, now cupid uh, cupid is a uh, is a angel so divine is using or or whoever you believe in universe is using all these angelic um, what are they called like all like all kind of angels or all kind of divine entities to help you with this connection we have lady venus we have archangel jermiel we have cupid so yes there is definitely pure love and romance and a lot of romance for you a lot of romance for you one might be a fire sign the other one might be an air sign doesn't have to be both might have fire in their chart so there is definitely a lot of romance in this connection for sure a lot of romance because we did get the card of romance pure love pure intention that one flew away let's see what more what more what more you are being told called to be a bit patient oh sexual union yes this is definitely going to happen and there are chances of it turning into 
for, you know, like having a child as well, having a kid as well, if that is what your intention is. Because we did get three cards about fertility over here. So yes, if you don't want if you don't want that to happen, you need to be careful. Sexual honor, honor the place in one another where you are one internal soul. For there you will find true bliss. So when you actually come together, become one, you will find the kind of bliss, true bliss, pure bliss, pure happiness which you never felt with any of your past partners. This is a beautiful high level soulmate connection. This is a very high level connection where when your energies exchange, you connect with each other at such a deeper level that you never, never experience that. Like your, your souls are meeting, your souls are, get, are being united. And, you, you ha and after this, there will be a lot of honor, a lot of respect for each other, a lot of love for each other. The love will only deepen after it. You will find true love for sure. And your it there will be a point where you both will be like one soul, one soul. This is definitely happening for you. So don't worry about it. It's a very, very romantic connection. Highly romantic, but a very pure connection. Very pure. Divine connection, that is what I'm feeling religious factor so there might be religious factor also because of which they are feeling bonded that also might be a situation your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path or maybe because of some religious upbringing or spiritual path or some spiritual belief there is something which is holding them or you back something might be affecting let's see what more This could be the one you have already met the romantic partner you seek. So this person might be someone you already know. You already are in connection with. You already know this person. Even if you were not in a romantic connection with them, you definitely know this person. Flirt. Extend your light-hearted energy to others. So initially maybe you will have to, you will be flirting with each other for a long time till everything is settled, till everything is taken care of. And then you will, yeah, you deserve love. And we do, and there is a beautiful coincidence over here. We have playfulness also. Let's not take all the cards and engagement also. So you deserve love. So we can see Cupid and arrow over here. We can see uh, like angels, baby angels with like Cupids. We can see bow and arrow. Sagittarius is also which is coming up. You are lovable. So you deserve love. So they'll find you extremely lovable, extremely adorable. Someone they absolutely adore, absolutely love. So that is what is happening and engagement. So there will be higher level commitment for sure. Your love life is ascending at higher level of commitment. So yes, you will commit to each other for sure and playfulness. So there will be a lot of playfulness in this relationship. To re recapture romance, allow your inner youthful uh, spirit to of fun to shine. So at present, just be playful and flirty with them. Don't try to make them feel uh, like they have to make the decisions right now or have to make some, like they have to come up with solutions right now. They do need time for that. There are some factors which they cannot, uh, like which will make them think over a lot of things so give them some time but you can capture each other's heart by being playful by being flirty by have by enjoying this beautiful connection you are having with each other and you do deserve love for sure if you had that doubt in your mind that do i deserve this or is this right yes you do deserve this love my weakness is you my knees wobble when i see you so maybe they saw you uh, maybe on social media maybe somewhere else and they do then they started having these intense feelings for you which they cannot hide anymore they consider you as their weakness your fragrance is intoxicating i would love to smell that forever so maybe when you're closer this is something which they will absolutely love whatever you use maybe lavender because we did see lavender i'm not being awkward i'm trying to seduce you so maybe the playfulness or flirtiness will turn a bit awkward sometimes. We were meant to be. The whole universe conspired to bring us together. I'm so grateful for this love. It's a blessing. Yeah, they will consider you as a blessing. Okay. Twin flames, a spiritual and romantic relationship. 
So yes, we did feel that they are a soulmate, but they can be a twin flame as well. Magnetic, strong chemistry, powerful pull. Yes, you do have a very powerful pull towards each other. That is that is there. A very powerful pull. Real love is deliberately choosing each other, loving each other, standing by each other. Thank you for teaching me how to love unconditionally. We did see unconditional love with the mother over here. So maybe they they think that you are the one who taught them unconditional love. My eyes and hearts are just heart. I'm sorry, it's a mistake. My eyes and heart are are just for you everything is flying away playful we got this energy again playfulness or uh, youthful flirty light-heartedness flirt also we got again so playful flirting will be going on for a while till you guys find that um, commitment fine to make it more solid in my i'm in my bed you're in your bed one of us is in the wrong place yes so there will be some distance distance involved initially as you wish law of attraction manifest desire so if you if you know how to use law of attraction techniques this is this you can put all your resources to use to bring this into reality manifest this so that they get the help they want as well can i kiss you again like after every time I wake up and before every night I go to sleep, can I have that kiss again for the rest of my life? Something when you're together, this is what they would love to do. It has always been you. I'm s sorry to not make it clear before, but I am so much in love with you. So yes, maybe you know this person in the from the past and they, they are saying this to you that you have always, always been on their mind. It has always been you. They could never get over you. Our time apart has only made me certain that I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Let's pick a town. So you might even discuss a town, a place where you would like to settle down with each other. It's so strange you made me stronger and became my weakness. So you will help them find the right solution or help them become stronger. But you are also their weakness. And we saw this message twice that you are their weakness. So this is what I have for you, pile number three. I hope you enjoyed the reading. Thank you again for being here. I'll see you in my next one.